And how you doing, Sister Purple Rain? Purple Rain, you got a minute for the words of the Lord? No. Now you you need to come over here and get the words of God. That's right. Now you, if you got it, you wouldn't be celebrating Halloween. Right. All right, man. Okay. All people is destroyed for a lack of knowledge, man. I apologize. It's a damn freak show out here, man. That don't make no damn sense, man. Read that. The book of Second Ezra, chapter uh, five and verse twenty-three, and said, "O oh Lord, that Doris rule." Of every wood of the earth. So the Most High God created every wood of the earth, right? All the trees, read. And of all the trees thereof, thou hast chosen thee one only vine. So the Most High God has a chosen tree, right? Right, so read. And of all the lands of the whole world, thou hast chosen thee one pick. So we finna get into everything that the Lord chose because the Lord created everything on the earth but the Lord has a favorite of everything that he created. Right. And it's time for our people to understand that. Right. A lot of people get mad and say well, well God loves everybody. Right. God created everybody so that must mean he has to love everybody. But that's not according to the Bible. Right. Don't people don't people have their favorite uh, outfit? Right. Don't people have a favorite color, a favorite food, a favorite TV show? Right? A favorite pair of shoes? Right? A favorite song? So why can't God have favorites? Right? They don't make no sense. Ain't we made in the image of God? Right? Right? And they're going to be late to the kingdom too. They don't repent, keep the commandments. Church two weeks ago. No, this is the church right here. Right? Two weeks ago. Yeah, two weeks ago. That's madness, man. Right, so read that. And of all the flowers. Hey, y'all got a minute for the words of the Lord, family? Hey, family, y'all got two minutes for the words of the Lord? Read that. And of all the flowers, there of one lily. So out of all the flowers that the Lord created, he said he chose one lily. The Lord created many flowers. You got the rose, you got the dandelion, but the Lord said he. He chose the lily, right? Out of all the flowers he created, read. And of all the depths of the sea, thou hast filled the one river. One what? One river. Right, going into the Jordan River, right? Read. And of all building cities, thou hast hollowed Zion. Thou hast did what? Thou hast hollowed Zion. The Lord said his favorite city is Zion, which is the city of David, right? Jerusalem, read. Unto thyself, right? Read. And of all the fowls that are created, Thou hast named thee one dove. Even out of all the fowls which goes into the birds, right? The Lord created the eagles, the hawks, right? The owls, the falcons, the ravens. But he said he, he his chosen bird is the dove, read. Are you and of all the cattle. <laughs> hey, Beetlejuice, drop dead, all right? Right, you finished out here, man. You are coked up, you are drunk, right, read. And of all the cattle that are made, thou hast provided thee one sheep. Right? So even out of all the cattle, right? You got the goats, right? You got the rams, right? The ox. The Lord said he chose one sheep, read. And among all the multitude of people. Out of what? And of all the multitude of people. Right? So it's time for you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans to realize that out of all the multitudes and out of all the races of people, read. Thou hast gotten thee one people. Now God chose all the people. One people. I love all people. One people. The Lord said he hath chosen him one people out of all the races upon the face of the earth. Right? The Lord hath gotten him one people. Right? And we going to find out who that one people is according to the Bible. Read. And unto this people whom thou lovest. Whom thou what? Whom thou lovest. So the Lord said this race of people whom he loves. Right? According to the Bible, what nation of people did God love? Let me get Malachi 1 and 1. We're going to show you. Right? We're going to show you what people that God love, right? Hey, do y'all beautiful sisters got a minute for the words of God? Nah, they don't believe in them. Hey, I'm talking to y'all. Y'all got two minutes for the words of God? Do y'all believe in the Lord? You know the word of God? Are you sure about that? Okay, well, let me get 1 Timothy 2 and 9. Let me see if y'all if know this. I'm going to see if y'all know this scripture, right? Because you say you know the words of God, right? All right, so we're going to see if you know this scripture. Let me get 1 Timothy 2 and 9. 1 Timothy 2 and 9. All right, 
the book of 1 Timothy, chapter 2 and verse 9. Oh, you say you, you know the word, right? Let's... In like, in like manner also that women at what that women adorn themselves in modest apparel. In what? In modest apparel. Oh, you go, hold on. Where you going? Where you going? Oh, okay. Wow, so she want to be promiscuous. Adorn themselves. That's the that's the problem, sister. Read. In modest apparel. In what? In modest apparel. So you said you you know the Bible, right? So did you know that scripture? Hold on, did you know that scripture? Nothing modest about it. Hold on, do you know that scripture? Okay, so are you keeping the scripture? Hold on, hold on, wait a minute, sister. You said, are you are you going do you truly love God? I think that's what I'm trying to ask. Okay, so do you one? do you love God? Yes or no? Yes, I do. Or I, who am I talking to? Who am I? I know. Who am I talking to? Inform me. Inform me. Who the God? Who inform me? Who am I talking to? You talking to a God? You talking to a God? I'm, I'm talking to a bunch of shameless women. That That's right. That's right. She just said that she don't. She because you know, sister, 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 are you gonna repent? You see, well, that's a shameless woman. Right. She don't want to repent. I know that. Sister, put some clothes on, sister. Have some respect for yourself, sister. Hey, yo, 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 See them demons coming out? Yeah, that's the spirit. Yeah, they, they gonna take care of that. Let me get that. Let me get Sal right. We're gonna keep bringing these scriptures out. We're gonna keep bringing these scriptures out. Let me get Sal right. The dog, right? But she, that is shame based, will fear the Lord. Right? And guess what? They're not gonna do the right man like that. Right. They're not gonna come up against the right man, right? But they come up against their own brothers, man, right? And that's why these wicked ass bars gonna get their ass put to death. Let me get Amos uh, 5 and 10. Let me get the book of Amos chapter 5 verse 10. Right? Right, and that's why the Lord got to come back and put all these wicked ass women to death, man. Right? The so-called black woman has become a dirty, filthy, shameless woman, man. Right? right? Let me get that Amos 5 and 10. The book of Amos chapter 5 verse 10. They hate him. They do what? They hate him. That rebuke is in the gate. That do what? That rebuke is in the gate. The Lord said they hate them that rebuke it from the gate, man. She talking about she know the word, but she out here dressed like a damn slut, right? Out here dressed like a damn prostitute, right? Talking about that they know the word, man, right? And let me get the book. Let me get the book of uh, Second Kings chapter two and verse twenty-two, right? Hey, and the Lord might put that wicked ass to death tonight for coming up against the service of the Lord, right? Right? Let me get the book of Second Kings chapter two, verse twenty-two. Bring it out. The book of Second Kings chapter two and verse twenty-two. Bring it out. So the waters were healed unto this day, according to the saying of Elisha, which he spake. And he went up from thence unto Bethel. And as he was going up by the way, there came forth little children out of the city. Those women was like some damn little children, right? They had no order. They had no structure. Grown ass women acting like wild ass animals. Right. We, that came forth little children out of the sea and mocked him. And did what? And, and mocked him. him. And did what? And mocked him. him. So we gonna see the judgment of coming up against the service of the Lord. We, Have you and said to him, him go up, thou bald head. Say what? Go up, thou bald head. So they was mocking the service of the Lord, right? So we see the judgment of coming up against the service of the Most High, we. And he turned back and looked on them and cursed them. And did what? And cursed them. Right, let me get the book of Psalm chapter 105 verse 15. Right? And did what? And cursed them. And we gonna curse them, man. Huh? Right? We gonna curse them, man, for coming up against the service of the Lord. Right? Right? So we don't give a damn if you are people or not. The Lord said the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. Right? Right? So we gonna put a curse on those wicked ass witches, right? We gonna pray that the Most High destroy them, man, right? Salvation is not for everybody, even for our people. Right. The Lord said two thirds of our people gonna get their ass put to death. That's right. Cause they're wicked as hell and they don't wanna repent. Bring it out. Right. 
Right? We gonna see if they got that same bold spirit in these last days when all hell break loose. Right. Right when the power boys come out here. Right. We gonna see if they go if they gonna come up against them like that. Right. Right. We gonna see if they come up against the KKK like that. Right. Right. But they wanna come up against their own brothers, man. Right. Read. And curse them in the name of the Lord. And then what? And curse them in the name of the Lord. And we gonna curse those wicked ass witches in the name of the Lord, man. In the name of Yahweh. Why Yahweh shot? Read. Right. And there came forth two she bears. What? Two she bears right. out of the wood and tear forty and two children, children. of them. And then what? And tear forty two children of them. Right. So we gonna pray that the Lord bring judgment to those wicked ass witches, man. Right. We gonna pray that the Lord bring judgment, man. No, right? Okay. How dare you come up against the servants of the Lord, man? Right? Read what you got. The book of Psalms, chapter 105, verse 15. Hey, if the most high God put little children in death, what you think he gonna do to those wicked ass women? Yep. Right. Those shameless women. Those damn whores and those damn harlots. Yep. Read. Say, touch not mine anointed. Do what? Touch not mine anointed. The Lord said, touch not, not my anointed. Right? You can't come up here and touch and put your hands on the service of the Lord. Read. And do my prophets no harm. And do what? And do my prophets no harm. The Lord said, do my prophets no harm. Read. Verse 16. Moreover, he called for a famine upon the land. He did what? He called for a famine upon the land. And do y'all got a minute for the words of the Lord? Well, y'all gonna be destroyed and the guy gonna put y'all wicked ass to death. That's right. That's right. Just like a whore. Put on some damn clothes and act like you got some damn sense. Right? The Lord not dealing with no dirty, filthy ass carpet munchers. Right? Trifling. Hey, let me get Genesis. Let me get Genesis 19:24, man. Right? This place gonna be burned with fire, thus saith the Lord. Right. This place gonna get burned up by thermonuclear fire, thus saith the Lord. Right. We tired of this filthy, wicked, disgusting place. Looking at these dirty, filthy, disgusting dogs. Right? We want the Lord to bring judgment upon these nations and upon the wicked of all people that don't want to repent. Right? Bend it up. The book of Genesis, chapter 19. I'll start at 24. Then the Lord rained upon Sodom and upon Gomorrah. The Lord did what? The Lord rained upon Sodom and upon Gomorrah. The Lord said he rained upon Sodom and upon Gomorrah, which is modern day America. This is modern day Sodom. This is modern day uh, Gomorrah. Right, you got all type of whores out here half naked with no clothes on. Right. 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 No, you know, you hey, you need to put on some damn clothes and stop dressing like a damn slut. Right? Bring that up. And fire from the Lord. And what? And fire, fire from, from the Lord. Lord. The Lord gonna bring fire upon our enemies, upon all these wicked pale faced bastards, right? That continue to press our people. Right? Read. And fire from the Lord. Uh, we came out here to raise hell tonight. Right? I don't know if you notice or not, but we came out here to raise hell, man. Right? We came out here to conjure up spirits, man. Right? We in fire from the Lord out of heaven. And he overthrew those cities. He did what? And he overthrew those cities. And the Lord gonna overthrow the wickedness of this city. All these faggots, all these lesbians, right? all these damn carpet munchers, all these dirty ass pale faced white people, right? They're gonna get put to death. That's saith the Lord. That's right. Right, read. And he overthrew those cities and all the plain and all the inhabitants of the city and all the what? And all the inhabitants of the city. All the inhabitants of this wicked ass city gonna get burnt up. That's saith the Lord, man. Right? We tired of looking at this wickedness, man. Right? Hey, get get on somewhere. Yeah, now's not the time. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, that's good. You appreciate what we doing? That's good. Okay, stay right here. Matter of fact, stay right. We got something for you. No, don't take him away. We got some. Hey, matter of fact, tell her to come in real quick too. Hey, bring him over here. You see that? The wicked fleet. You see that? They know who was. They already knew what's gonna happen. Right. We ain't out here playing no damn games with your heathens. You talking about you appreciate what we doing? If you appreciate what we doing, get your bum ass on the damn ground and look at the damn dust. Right. right. The hell you talking about? You appreciate what we doing? If you appreciate what we doing, get your crusty, pale face ass on the damn ground where you belong and kiss the boots at the service of the Most High God. Right. We don't want to hear a damn thing that you got to say. Right. The so-called white man been running his damn mouth for far too long. Right. We don't 
don't want to hear a damn thing that he got to say, man. The Lord is about action, right? If you feel bad for what your people did to the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, you have to put forth the actions, right? So where I had you at? Right, yeah. Before them damn Jezebels came up here. Yeah. Second edges. Let me, let me get back to that second edges, right? Hey, all praises, man, right? We came out here to, to uh, conjure up demons in these last days, man. Right. Right? We came out here to raise hell, man, right? People don't like when the prophets come out here on these streets, right? Yeah, yeah. Then Jeremiah get smit, right? Then Jeremiah get beat up, then the prophets and the, and the apostles get thrown in jail, right? They don't like when the true servants of the Lord come out here on these streets, man, right? We raise hell out here on these streets. Read that. Verse 27, and among all the multitudes of peoples, thou hast gotten thee one people. And unto this people whom thou lovest, whom thou what? Whom, whom thou, thou lovest. And the Most High God say He loves His people. That's the only reason why we out here. But guess what? Our people don't want the love of the Lord. Right. They want the love of the so-called white man, right? They don't want the love of God. They want the love of these dirty ass bastards, right? The same people that oppress them, right? The same people that murder them, the they same people them. that rape them, the same people that rob them, right? Read. Thou read that verse again. And among all the multitudes of peoples, thou hast gotten thee one people. Thou hast gotten what? Thou hast gotten thee one people. Uh, it's back on? Uh, please, let me get Malachi 1 and 1. So read that part again. And among all the multitudes of peoples, thou hast gotten thee one people. And unto this people whom thou lovest. So the Lord said, this people whom thou lovest. Who is that people that God loves, according to the Bible? Because it's not everybody. Right? Contrary to what your, what your pastor tell you on Sunday. Right. Right? So let's find out that nation of people that God loves. Hey, come in the word, bro. Read that. Come in the word. It's the book of Malachi, chapter 1 from the top. The burden of the word of the Lord to Israel. To who? To Israel. This is the word of the Lord to the children of Israel. Read. By Malachi. By who? By, By Malachi. Malachi. By Malachi, the prophet Malachi. Read. Verse 2. I have loved you, saith the Lord. No, the Lord loved everybody. I have loved you. Said the Lord. The Lord said he loved the children of Israel, the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. I see that. Yes. Yet you say, wherein hast thou loved them? Right, that was it on that. So the Lord said he loved the children of Israel. Let me get uh, Baruch 3 and uh, 36. Let me get the Baruch chapter 3 verse 36. Right? So the Most High God said he loves the children of Israel. That's the people that God loves. Right? The Lord, the Lord don't love everybody. Right? And even of our people, the Lord said he hates the sinners of his people. Right. Right? So even if you were Israelite, if you break in the law, statutes, and commandments of the Lord, the Lord said he hates you. Right? And you liable to get put to death. Right? Baruch uh, 3 and 36. It's the book of Baruch, chapter 3, verse 36. He hath found out all the way of knowledge and hath given it unto Jacob. That's uh, Baruch 3 and 36. God. He hath found out all the way of knowledge and hath given it unto Jacob. I have given it to everybody. I have given it unto Jacob. The Lord said he hath given it unto Jacob. Right? Read. His servant. And to Israel. And to who? And to Israel. To everybody. And to Israel. And to the children of Israel. Read. His beloved. His what? His beloved. His what? His beloved. I'd say his beloved, right? The most high God's beloved is the 12 tribes and the children of Israel. Not every nation, right? Read on. Read down to verse uh, 27. Hey, hey, let me, hey, let me ask you a question. Yeah, let me ask you a question. Now, hey, let me ask you a question real quick. Somebody give me that poster. That poster right there. Yeah, let me ask you a question. How do you feel about this? Right. No, let's nah, just look at it. Just look at it. Well, you're covering half the world. Well, look, I mean, you see all them pictures right there. What, you know what you're looking at? 
you're looking at so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans in slavery hanging from trees, getting burned alive, and getting whipped. Right. So who did this to these people? Not my answer. You said, wait a minute, hold, hold on. Get this, hold the hell on. You said, say that again. You said what? I'm from Ireland, brother. You from Ireland? Yeah. So what does that mean? <laughs> I ain't out here. My family wasn't here in 1700. You said your we family came, We came here in the so, so what does that mean? So this is not, is this not your people that did this? No, we're all. Are the Irish? We're, hold on, we're, are the Irish? We're all the same people. Who's all? Who, what do you mean? Who all? All the same people? Who do you mean all? Sure hold on, wait a minute. Hold on. What do you mean all of us the same people? What do you mean? You talking about every race of people is the same? Yes. Yes. All is that is that what the Bible say? We're all human. Hold on. First of all, we're not all human, because human means people of color. But you, you don't have the same color we have. Right. We have melanin, you don't have melanin. Right. So how are we all the same? Right? Don't your people burn up in the sun? Don't your people get skin cancer? Do that happen to our people? Hell no. Right? So how are we all the same? Hey, your mother, come here the word. Hey, superwoman, come here the word. Hold on real quick. Where you going? You, you said we are the same, right? Is that what the Bible said? Do you believe in the Bible? Does the Bible, does God say that we are the same? All right, we all better get ready for that captivity, all right? I'm going to have your ass in the, in the cotton field, all right? I'm going to need you to do a whole bunch of push-ups and sit-ups, all right? Get ready for that captivity, all right? That's madness, man. He's talking about we are the same people, right? But I bet he can't stand in the sun as long as I can. Right. Right? Sound